So the entropy is, if I, I just copy it, so, so, so S is, entropy is minus K, K should be the Boltzmann constant, right? Yeah. yeah. And then N is the uh, number of particle, total number of particle, and you sum over Y from one to M. M is the number of state, right? Right. Get it correctly. Capital M. Right. And then PI. Yeah. PI. Right. This is you, what you got from the first part A, right? Okay. Then uh, what you need to do is uh, maximize S. Uh, plus a the ground multiply or minus or plus or minus it doesn't matter the constraint the constraint is sum over all the all the um, probability equals to one to minus one is zero right so you want to maximize this one this function right and lambda is your the ground multiplier uh, so to do that, uh, you need to do a partial derivative. We, we already use I, so all the, say like PJ, yeah. that's the zero. Right? And equals partial plus PJ. S is minus K in the yeah. sum of I, I yeah, PI minus same thing. Right. And so uh, what you get is the first term you have minus k n, and then do a derivative of this one with respect to p sub j. So only i equals to j will survive, right? And you do the derivative. And so therefore you have two terms or this one. One is taking the derivative of this one. So you have p, uh, log p j. P sub j, and then the other one is take a derivative of this one, so you get one over p, and cancel the numerator, so it's one a plus one, right? And then minus lambda, and the derivative of that you get the just p i equals to p j will give you one, other you give you zero, so that is just one that equals to zero, right? So quite obviously we solve for p sub j. Uh, so the log of p sub j is equals to put this to get as lambda minus lambda divided by k in um, minus one. But, so, but, and uh, what is this one? So, I mean, and then quite obviously this is, this doesn't depends on it doesn't depends on the uh, on j, right? So every every j is the same, every piece of j is the same. And basically, it's a constant. 
So lambda is a constant, n is a constant, everything is a constant. So now that uh, everything is a constant, so this constraint becomes sum of i equals to one to m pj, p sub j is a constant, so you can put that out and call it just p. So all the p sub j or p sub i equals to just p, right? And sum over one. Okay, so one, and this is just M. So P is just one of M, right? So that's, that's why I'm saying this is trivial, okay? Once you get that, uh, of course, you can express your Lagrange multiply in terms of this, one, but this is actually not important now, because when you figure out that uh, all the P should be, constant when you maximize the entropy subject to the constraint, then you can express your final answer in just some of the, I mean, this is also a constant, so it becomes one over m log one over m, and then your m of that, so you multiply by m, so you cancel with that. So finally, it's just minus, this is one over that, so it's Km, Kn log n. Right. So you, you know the logic, so it's kind of uh, just a trivial process. Yeah. Uh, 